sold the bank and yet one of the tribute people of his cousin of the Iranian on the ground. They are all just helped themselves. So, the men, the shell was born a ramen, the one that I love, malt whiskey and company. They then bought a distillery from Speyside, brand new, and they became Island Distillers. Island Distillers, in one form or another, owned us up to about 15 years ago. Uh, they became the Everton Group, who owned McAllen, Island Flat, and one of the famous blends, uh, the famous Crown. And they owned us right up to 15 years ago. Then they sold us to uh, Bud Stewart, who first the owners. We did a lot of uh, changes. From when I was employed right up to Bud Stewart, we took over. We only experimented twice in making Peaky's whiskey. Now we make Peaky's whiskey every year, which is a bonus for everybody. It's to sell it to customers <coughs> and to keep some stock for ourselves. We bought more than money and it's very popular. The snow is overwhelming as the lights are flying in our bag. It's still got the, the nice sweetness. You want to have it, but it has that Isla element to it. Most people who drink it want to have for the first time are confused. They don't think it's an Isla moment. This is what they drink. So you got in the distillery in Isla, all except one that will remain nameless. You'll find that all the distillers walk right back to the shore. That's when most of them were all over 100 years old and were first bought. Transport then, these days, is transport by boat, as it is today. Smaller boats, we all have their own fears. Everything would be brought in. Right to the pier, right to the road pier. With coal, with barley, and we malted our own barley. With barrels, with yeast, anything we require at the distillery would be transported to the pier. We make the whiskey, ship it down the pier, into the boats, small poppers, to the coast of the check back to the mainland of like London and Portland. These days, much the same thing happens. We don't bring it, we, up until about 20 years ago, we would bring it from all the barley and by sea into the pier here where we could offload it. That became very expensive. Yeah, it's quite expensive. Yeah. 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 Y